The Institute of Physics (IOP) is a scientific charity that works to advance physics education, research and application. It has a worldwide membership of over 50,000. The IOP supports physics in education, research and industry. In addition to this, the IOP provides services to its members including careers advice and professional development and grants the professional qualification of Chartered Physicist as well as Chartered Engineer as a nominated body of the Engineering Council. The IOP's publishing company, IOP Publishing, publishes more than 70 academic journals and magazines. History The Institute of Physics was formed in 1960 from the merger of the Physical Society, founded as the Physical Society of London in 1874, and the Institute of Physics, founded in 1920. The Physical Society of London had been officially formed on 14 February 1874 with John Hall Gladstone as its first president. From its beginning, the Society held open meetings and demonstrations and published proceedings of the Physical Society. In the early part of the 20th century, the profession of physicist emerged, partly as a result of the increased demand for scientists during World War I. In 1917, the Council of the Physical Society, along with the Faraday Society, the Optical Society, London, and the Roentgen Society, started to explore ways of improving the professional status of physicists. In 1920, the Institute of Physics was created under special license from the Board of Trade. Sir Richard Glazebrook was elected first president of the Institute. As with the Physical Society, dissemination of knowledge was fundamental to the Institute, which began publication of the Journal of Scientific Instruments in 1922. The annual reports on progress in physics began in 1934 and is still published today. In 1952, the Institute began the graduateship course and examination, which ran until 1984 when the expansion of access to universities removed demand. In 1960, the Physical Society and the Institute of Physics merged, creating a single organization with the unwieldy name the Institute of Physics and the Physical Society, which combined the learned society tradition of the Physical Society with the professional body tradition of the Institute of Physics. Under the leadership of Thomas E. Nevin, an Irish branch of the Institute of Physics was formed in 1964. Upon being granted a royal charter in 1970, the organization was renamed as the Institute of Physics. Topic: Membership. There are 4 grades of membership: associate member, member, minutes TP, fellow of the Institute of Physics, Fins TP, and honorary fellow. Undergraduates, apprentices and trainees can become associate members, and qualification for Minutes TP is normally by completion of an undergraduate degree that is «recognised» by the Institute, this covers almost all UK physics degrees. A Minutes TP can become an FINS TP by making «an outstanding contribution to the profession». These four grades of membership replaced the previous seven grades in January 2018. The changes introduced then removed affiliate memberships for undergraduates, they are now associate members, removed the post nominal letters Amin STP, and allowed automatic qualification as full members after graduation. Associate members are also now voting members. The Institute grants academic dress to the various grades of membership. Those who have passed the Institute's graduateship examination offered 1952 to 1984 are entitled to a violet damask Oxford Bergen shaped hood. Corporate members are entitled to wear a hood of Toronto full shape in violet damask, lined in violet and faced on the cowl with two 5 cm shot crimson silk. The gown for members and those who have passed the graduateship examination is the same pattern as that used by the University of London for their Bachelor of Arts, but with the sleeves loped by violet cords and buttons, the fellow's gown follows the pattern of the doctor's robes of Oxford University in black with according to Groves 2014 4 inches cuffs in violet damask, or according to the IOP website, 15 cm cuffs and 10 cm facings in violet taffeta, the cuffs slightly gathered with red cords and violet buttons. Fellows wear a doctor's bonnet in black velvet with red tassels, other grades wear a standard black mortarboard with black tassels. <laughs> Professional qualifications 
The institute grants the professional title of Chartered Physicist under its own charter, Chartered Engineer as a nominated body of the Engineering Council, and Registered Scientist and Registered Science Technician as a licensed body of the Science Council. Until 1998 CPHYs was granted automatically with minutes TP, however since then it has become a separate qualification that is equal in stature to Chartered Engineer. From 2012, it requires revalidation every three years. In order to gain the CPHYs qualification, a physicist must be appropriately qualified an accredited MSCI or MPHYs integrated master's degree is standard, although experience leading to an equivalent level can be counted, have had a minimum of two years of structured training and a minimum of two years responsible work experience, have demonstrated a commitment to continuing professional development, and have gained a number of competencies. Education The IOP accredits undergraduate degrees BSc, BA and MSCI, MPHYs in physics in British and Irish universities. At post-16 level, the IOP developed the Advancing Physics a level course, in conjunction with the OCR Examining Board, which is accredited by the Qualifications and Curriculum Authority. Advancing Physics was sold to Oxford University Press in January 2011. The IOP also developed the Integrated Sciences degree, which is run at four universities in England. The IOP provides an important educational service for secondary schools in the UK. This is the lab in Alori, a mobile laboratory in a large articulated truck. This has three small laboratories where schoolchildren can try out various hands-on experiments, using physics equipment not usually available in the average school laboratory. Sponsorship is provided by EDF Energy and support from the British Science Association. IOP runs the Stimulating Physics Network, aimed at increasing the uptake of physics at A level, and administers teacher training scholarships funded by the Department for Education. The Institute is also interested in the ethical impact of physics, as is witnessed through the Physics and Ethics Education Project. Publishing IOP Publishing is a wholly owned subsidiary of the IOP that publishes more than 70 academic titles. Any profits generated by the publishing company are used to fund the IOP. It won the Queen's Award for Export Achievement in 1990, 1995 and 2000 and publishes a large number of journals, websites and magazines, such as the Physics World Membership Magazine of the Institute of Physics, which was launched in 1988. Governance An elected council governs and controls the affairs of the institute. The council meets four times a year and has up to 25 members of whom 16 are elected by members of the institute. The president is elected by the membership of the institute and serves a term of two years. The current president is Professor Dame Julia Higgins. The history of the Institute, from its founding as the Physical Society of London through to today's Institute, has meant that the name of the post held has varied. <laughs> <laughs> awards The Institute awards numerous prizes to acknowledge contributions to physics research, education and application. The Isaac Newton Medal is awarded annually to any physicist, regardless of subject area, background or nationality, for outstanding contributions to physics. It is accompanied by a prize of £1,000 and the recipient is invited to give the Newton Lecture. The Michael Faraday Medal and Prize is a prize awarded annually for outstanding contributions to experimental physics to a physicist of international reputation in any sector. The Max Born Medal and Prize is awarded yearly by the German Physical Society and the Institute of Physics in memory of the German physicist Max Born. The prize recognizes, "...outstanding contributions to physics", and is awarded to physicists based in Germany and in the UK or Ireland in alternate years. The Catherine Burr Blodgett Medal and Prize is a prize awarded annually for outstanding contributions to the organization or applications physics to a physicist in an industrial or commercial context in any sector. 
The Rayleigh Medal and Prize, established in 2008, is awarded biennially, in odd-numbered years, for distinguished research in theoretical, mathematical or computational physics. The Ernest Rutherford Medal and Prize, awarded biennially in even-numbered years, was instituted in 1966, replacing the Rutherford Memorial Lecture. The award recognizes distinguished research in nuclear physics or nuclear technology and is named in honor of Lord Rutherford of Nelson. The Joseph Thomson Medal and Prize, established in 2008, is awarded biennially, in even-numbered years, for distinguished research in atomic including quantum optics or molecular physics. The Thomas Young Medal and Prize is awarded biennially, in odd-numbered years, for distinguished research in the field of optics, including physics outside the visible region. The Edward Appleton Medal and Prize is awarded for distinguished research in environmental, earth or atmospheric physics. Originally named after Charles Cree, it was established in 1941 and is currently awarded in even dated years. The Kelvin Medal and Prize instigated in October 1994 in recognition of the importance of promoting public awareness of the place of physics in the world, of its contributions to the quality of life and its advancement of an understanding of the physical world and the place of humanity within it. The Lees Meitner Medal and Prize, established in 2016, for distinguished contributions to public engagement within physics". The Marie Curie Sklodowska Medal and Prize was established in 2016 for "...distinguished contributions to physics education and to widening participation within it". The James Clerk Maxwell Medal and Prize, awarded annually since 1962 to recognize outstanding early career contributions to theoretical physics. The Daphne Jackson Medal and Prize, established in 2016, is awarded, "...for exceptional early career contributions to physics education and to widening participation within it". <laughs> <laughs> Headquarters Since its formation the Institute has had its headquarters in London. In 1927 the Institute acquired, rent-free, one Lothar Gardens. During the Second World War, the Institute moved temporarily to the University of Reading. After the war, the Institute returned to London, first to 19 Albemarle Street, where it stayed for little over a year, before moving to 47 Belgrave Square in December 1946. The Institute moved to 76 Portland Place in 1996. In 2013, the IOP bought a property in King's Cross, which will become its new headquarters. This has been the source of some controversy, as local residents objected to the design and size of the new building. After an initial approval in February 2015, it took almost 10 months of additional negotiation before planning permission was ultimately granted by the Islington Council in December 2015. The IOP moved into this new building the 29th of October 2018. Topic See also Chadwick Medal and Prize Physical Society of London Science Council